Lesson 5. Customize and download your icons. What if your brand uses specific colors? Wouldn't it be nice to adjust the colors of the icons you find on the platform so that they can match your brand identity? Well, the good news is that you can, and the level of customization on flaticon.com is pretty awesome. In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to customize your icons to your taste and download them in different formats. So let's start with a new search for icons. This time, let's use the keyword farmer and search for a pack. If I choose this pack, for example, I can see that I have two options, lineal colors or lineal. I will go for lineal because I'm looking for an icon pack in only one color. If I click on the eye of the first icon, a new window will open. And from here, you will be able to customize your icon. First, you will have to choose your format, and there are different options on flaticon.com. The first one is PNG, which is usually pronounced ping, as in ping pong. Uh, this format is ideal if you want to use the icon in the document, but also in your video creations, etc. It's the go-to or the all-around type of format. SVG is mostly used for your website by web designers and web developers. So if you're working with your web developers and he needs icons for your website, make sure you also export them in SVG. EPS is your best choice if you want to print the design later. It allows the highest resolution. You will need Photoshop or Illustrator to open it though. PSD is the Photoshop format if you wish to further transform your icon in Photoshop. And Base64 is commonly used when there is a need to encode binary data that needs to be stored or transferred over media that are designed to deal with textual data. I have personally never used it. If you are not an expert and don't know what all these formats are all about, don't panic. Just pick the PNG format and you will be fine. So, once you've chosen your format, you can now customize your icon. Flat Icon presents you with a few different colors, but if you click on the last dot, the one that looks like a rainbow, you will open the color wheel and you will be able to choose any color you want. If you know the hex code of the color you're looking for, you can just type it in in this box right here. Or you can play around with the slider until you find a color you like. If you need further customization, you can also click on the edit icon button, which will let you not only adjust the color, but also the position and size of your icon. Once you're satisfied with your icon, you can either add it to your collection or download it. If you went for the PNG format, you will have one more option to choose, and that is the resolution of your icon. You can choose between 16, 24, 32, 64, 128, 256, or 512 pixel. I personally always choose the highest resolution, 512 pixel, and then I reduce the size of my icon if needed with a photo editor software or with Canva. And I do that to guarantee the best result. If you choose a resolution which is too low, your icon might look pixelated. So once you have chosen your resolution, Flat Icon will prompt you to choose between premium download, which is only available to paid subscribers, or free download, which is, well, free. The difference between the two options is that with the free option, you will have to give credit to the creator of the icon. And that's it. This is how you customize and download your icons.